Assalamu alaikum. Didn't hear you come in. Greetings and welcome to Ask That Guy with the Glasses. Why do people say ATM machine? The M stands for machine, so isn't it redundant? That's a very good question. Actually, it's not redundant because people aren't talking about ATM, they're talking about an ATM machine. The machines that make ATMs. Which, of course, isn't the machine that you go and get money from, it's the machine that makes the machine that you get money from. Which, of course, is still inaccurate. So the reason people call ATMs ATM machines is because they're unbelievably stupid but for a totally different reason that you didn't think about. Don't you feel like a selfish prick now? I don't. Do you think fried chicken Kool-Aid would be widely accepted by the general public? Yes. Yes, I do. But why stop there? You can have soda that tastes like bacon, orange juice that tastes like pork, and my personal favorite, martinis that taste like tampons. A tampontini, I would call it. Now I know what you're thinking. Tampons have nothing to do with meat or even anything that we regularly eat. Well, this is my way of using sarcasm to point out how unbelievably retarded your question was. So, in conclusion, shut up. With onions. I'm working on designing a new form of cat that can shoot freeze rays from its eyes and fire projectiles from its ass. Should I have it fire grenades or Chuck Norris's fists? Well, generally anything Chuck Norris related is going to be preferred. Hell, Chuck Norris's saliva would be an improvement to whatever you're making. For as we all know, he drools acid and eats other people's muscles for breakfast. So naturally, anything with Chuck Norris is always going to be, what the hell are you making? Whose line is it anyway? The Hummel figurine. My babushka is made out of the ass of Clifford the dog. And one day you... They'll always have the last word. And your soul. Yes. If someone was on fire, would they be burning calories? Actually, no, they wouldn't. So there's only one logical conclusion to draw from this. People on fire are lazy. Come on, folks, stop trying to put yourself out and start exercising. How about a jog or lifting some weights? Simply shouting in agonizing terror isn't going to help you lose weight at all. It's just going to make you fat. Setting yourself on fire is not the way to go. Unless you're dying, then it's an awesome way to go. Wait a minute, this isn't right. Much better. Why do Christians say that abstinence is the only sure way to avoid getting pregnant, when it didn't work for Mary? Well, if there's anything that we can learn from the Virgin Mary, it's that if you stay a virgin, you'll most likely give birth to our Lord and Savior. Think about it, ladies. What would you prefer? Several nights of unbelievable sex? or a beautiful, honorable son that you can be proud of for the rest of your it's sex, isn't it? Yep, sex feels better, therefore it is better. Fuck on, ladies. Starting with me. Are you still doing S that guy with the glasses? If violence is the answer, then what is the question? Usually can I borrow a cup of sugar? I really hate that question, and anyone who asks it deserves to be punched. It's my sugar, and I bought it with my own money. So the next time someone asks you to borrow a cup of sugar, simply do this. Hi, can I borrow a cup of sugar? That'll teach him. How much money would it take for you to kill a puppy with a sledgehammer? Oh gee, now that is a very, very difficult question. I mean, the moral dilemmas, the ethical decisions. 200,000? No, no. 300. No, no, much higher than that. Six? Seven? Oh, let's just cut to the chase. One million. I would pay one million dollars to kill a puppy with a sledgehammer. And it would be worth every penny. Fucking puppies. With onions. How many licks does it take to get to the Tootsie Roll center of a Tootsie Pop? Let's find out. One, a two, a three. <laughs> Oh my god, he shot me! And Owl just shot me! No! No, the secret must be revealed! False! <laughs> this is Mr. Owl saying, there's no such thing as a stupid question, except how many licks does it take to get to the Tootsie Roll center of a Tootsie Pop? A three. <laughs> 